Alright, I'm back in Strawberry Jam. It has been eight and a half total hours of playing now, and I've completed the beginner lobby. And, um, I said that I would probably go back for, you know, the silver berries and berry cleanup, but to be honest, it doesn't really interest me that much. Um, I really just want to go on with the intermediate lobby, and I have not seen anything about the intermediate lobby. For the beginner lobby, I was minorly spoiled on a lot of things, but I actually know nothing about the intermediate lobby as it stands right now. I... Ooh. I... I just want to say off the bat, I like this aesthetic more. And there are 18 levels instead of 21. And we've got the gym. I think I'll already know all the tech I'm gonna need for intermediate lobby. This is our first level. Sea of Soup by Spoopy Soup. Oh, Spoopy Soup, that's the person that made the artwork in Into the Jungle. Theoretically, this should be a bit harder than the red difficulty ones from Beginner Lobby. What did it- I still- I don't understand what the difference is between the purple and the red one. It just takes longer? I, there's gotta be something else. Are these just reskinned red and green orbs? They just seem like normal, except the purple ones don't seem exactly like red orbs. Whoa. Well, that's a dash. So we have screen wrap. What? It falls down. Or it falls up. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Huh. Why does it take so long to activate? I don't understand. I guess maybe the only reason why they take longer to to activate now is is just uh so they're easier. Like I guess. For some reason I thought that was a wall. Dude, what? Why can I wall jump off that? Or wall bounce? Wait. I guess that's how I do it, but why can I wall bounce off that? That is so counterintuitive. I can reverse with them. That's interesting. Oh, the red! The red now, because we're at intermediate. Okay, five strawberries, Jesus. Let's try without dashing at all. Oh no! Let's go, I got it. I kinda wanted to look at my, yeah, book. Sea of Soup, Pufferfish Transportation Company. That sounds cool. Pointless machines, like the heart in the vanilla game. What's, or what is this? Sleeping Under Stars? Frosted Fragments. And this is another green. Why, why did I just do that? Shit. Probably need to hit this for later in the screen. Okay, that's not too bad. This shit's easy. Oh shit, I died. This is a really cool map so far. I think I need that double dash. That would make sense. Uh-huh, I did. 
I'm liking this much more than the soup level. I'll say that much. Okay. Oh shit. We're too early once again. I always rush it even though I don't need to. Still, this is only intermediate. I may be bad, but I'm using two advanced techniques. Oh my gosh, I did not- I was not looking there, to be completely honest. Oh, there's nothing down there. Oh, I need to dash. Dash it fast. This is like flow gameplay that plays itself, I don't even need to think about it. If I don't think about it and just do what it's telling me to do, then I will succeed. Point. How in the fuck do you get in there? I'm missing every secret in this level. Jeez. If you take a double dash here, you can do that, but I have no idea how to get a double dash there. hit it on the sides with the red? Has that been a thing the whole time and I didn't realize? I mean, yeah, I'm not really paying attention to how it works, just what the game is telling me to do. Oh, if I... Oh, I see, it's not just the red. I don't really know what the red means. Is oh, that means it sticks to the walls! I get it, I get it. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Alright, cool. At least I got one strawberry, but I'm definitely missing shit. Awesome. The source lies at the bottom of this ravine. Please, if you are able, find a way to stop it. As for me, I won't last much longer in these conditions. Serves me right, I suppose, in my project, my life's work. All finished and only fragments remain. Jesus. Do I have to hit something on the way down? Oh, I have to hit that block. I've been not hitting that block even though you're supposed to. That probably gives me something to hold on to. Yeah. Oh shit. Seems like we're at the bottom of the ravine now. Did we get a conclusion to the story? Huh. I want to play as many new levels as I can. Fifth dimension. Let's see what this one holds. Is this gonna be another puzzle level? Bruh. It's another drop soul. GG. This one doesn't seem like a puzzle level. It seems like actual platforming. Oh, are you expected to know how to wall, wall bounce? Awesome. Yeah, we're at intermediate now, baby. Gotta know what a wall bounce. Oh, this level is... I am sold already. This level is sick. Nice. Oh, this level is so satisfying.
But it's still not enough. Ah, I see. I see, that's what the arrows were telling me. I think I gotta go back to the bubble. Oh, I don't regain my dash from the bubble. These are the soap bubbles. This might be my favorite level of the whole mod. I'm not I'm not joking. So far. Maybe I have to burn a dash there. Awesome. I wish it had a few more rooms, but that was awesome. That was fucking awesome. No strawberries. So cool. Okay, well, I've done three levels now of 18. Fifth Dimension, definitely my favorite um, so far in the Intermediate Lobby. Frosted Fragments was really fun too. See if Soup was fine. <laughs> I guess we'll see what the other ones have after uh, I take a break. Alright, it is June 17th, 2024, which means it's uh, day three of Strawberry Jam. If these are ever going to be uploaded, I don't know when they're going to be uploaded, uh, but let's get into it. And hopefully this lag clears up soon. Alright, Supernautica. This is a yellow difficulty map. And the first one, the first yellow. This is the first intermediate yellow I've played. Uh, is this requiring super dashing? Maybe. Does not kill me. Apparently, Cloud to Bull is con confirmed cheating as of minutes ago. As of minutes ago. <laughs> as I said before, it's June 17th, 2024. Osu 911. Yeah, um. Cloud to is still unbanned on Osu as of, oh. Uh, right now, and he just admitted to cheating, or Plasma said he did. Yeah, I guess we're at the point now where they are expecting wave dashes, wall bounces, super dashes. Oh my gosh, yeah, I have to do one right there. Oh, I need... There's a lot of super dashing in this map. I mean, I assume it's... I assume it's intended. I don't know how else you're supposed to do this. This is really cool. I like this level. Is this for a strawberry? Maybe I just need to th throw it back. Yeah, I think so. No. I need to throw it back at the right time. Okay, I need to stop saying throw it back. There we go. So I guess that pipe is just long so that it gives a chance to collect the coin. I really like the difficulty of these intermediate levels so far. This was like the kind of difficulty that I wanted to play starting um, Modded Celeste, which does make me scared for the intermediate lobby and expert, of course. I mean, I already knew Grandmaster was going to be fucking impossible for me. There are like, platforms and stuff. 
It's like this place has been overgrown. It's like Hollow Knight. Okay, that's how you do it. What is over here? Wait, is this just the way I'm supposed to be going? Oh, this is a strawberry. I think I missed a strawberry back there because I thought I was going to the strawberry path. Okay, this is the last screen. I definitely missed a strawberry, probably more than one. Oh, I did only miss one, and I'm pretty sure I know exactly where it is. That's cool. Oh, that is an extremely easy strawberry. Oh my gosh, wait, these are the mushrooms from Into the Jungle. They're the exact same mushrooms. Are we gonna have an Into the Jungle level? Because that would be awesome. I'll just play this. What the heck is this? Pufferfish Transportation Co. And this is a red. This is my first intermediate red. How am I not getting flung? I like how holding the other direction doesn't fling you farther, like in vanilla. Makes it so you don't have to think about as much. I'm still gonna do it anyway, probably, though. Is that a bird? Oh, wait. I should have probably looked at that box. Okay. I need to somehow move the fish to the right. Oh, I see. There we go. Oh. I get it. I have to actually think. Strawberry. Oh, I have an idea. Oh, that's what I need to do. My idea would not have worked. <sighs> Shit. What? Why does the strawberry have a pufferfish range? Oh my gosh, come on. All right, this is pretty easy. Dude, where in the fuck is my strawberry? Hello? Wait. When I get when when a fish explodes, it disappears. That throws a wrench in my plan. Oh, I can just do that. I don't even need to deal with going to the wall. I was overcomplicating it. That makes sense. Collect it. Nice. Oh, I'm just supposed to do that. I made that room so much harder for myself than I needed to. Was that the last room too? I don't think so. Are we in the shed? Gold winged strawberry. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Is this the last room? Oh my gosh. They were right about coming in with a plan. For these levels, cause like... 
uh, I will probably wouldn't have come up with all the wrong things to do. Do I need to go back to the blue one? Because the blue is connected to the blue, and the yellow is connected to the yellow. That is a really interesting new mechanic. I don't know how I would have been able to use the binoculars on this one, because, like... I don't know how this shit's gonna go. Wait, can I... I should just be going on the left side. I thought I wouldn't be able to do that because of the spikes, but I can. Oh, I need to actually use the bounce from the puffer bit. Alright. Okay, so I need the fish to go through this clear pipe, past that, and then the springs to go up, which will propel it through this pipe, and then I need to jump on it here, which will... Put it there, and then if I jump on it again, it'll go through this pipe, collect the coin. And what did the green ones have to do with it? Jesus. Oh, I can probably... That's what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I need to enable the green in order for it to not go through the... for it to go back. Green blocks, go. Oh! Like that. Duh. This is a really cool room, I gotta say. There we go! Where's the web supposed to go? Oh! It's all for a berry if I can not be launched by any fish. So I need to do this room launchless. What the fuck? Can I do a hyper out of them? I can. Oh, I see. Huh? Oh shit. Huh. I don't understand how that's possible. So what I was trying to do is not correct. I'm I'm going to be real, I have no idea how to get this strawberry. I have absolutely no clue. There we go. Just had to put in a little bit of thought. Alright, we are in the shed. Let's see if I can sight read it. If I can't, I'll put in some thought. Bro, shut up. So much yapping in this level. Oh, I can just hang on. Okay. Is this 
a checkpoint? I hope this is a checkpoint. Oh. Was that for a strawberry? Real. We never got the $500,000. Okay, well that level was significantly harder than the other ones in this lobby. Still took me less time than a gift from the stars. Uh, I'll worry about strawberries later if I want to. And I don't particularly want to right now. So there is this level. Midnight Monsoon, it's another hard. I kinda wanna do a green or a yellow after that one. I like this hub world so much. The lobby for intermediate. I like this, this aesthetic more than the beginner lobby. Deep blue, it's another, it's another red one. Pointless machines, another red one. Where the fuck am I? I think I need to go to the left to get some easier ones. Like, what is this? Vertigo. Let's do it. Whoa. I like this. Black and white style. So what happens if I... I teleport. Sick. This is cool, this is really cool. I'm interested. Oh. We are now upside down. Whoops, I pressed up. Oh, what the fuck? This is fucking with my mind. That is some brain fuckery. Oh my gosh. Vertigo is right. Oh my god, I meant to go down, not up. This is... No! It's so hard! This is kind of a similar aesthetic as uh, Dropsil was going for, but I like it a lot better in this. You can still tell what color your hair is, even... So it's black and white, which is very nice. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, I may have done a stupid. I literally just went back. What the fuck? Bro, don't expect me to wall bounce with the upside down. That's just insane. Oh my gosh, I'm supposed to be pressing down to go down. But it doesn't feel like that. Holy shit. That room is nuts! Ooh, I need to catch that wall. Okay, I'm getting into the groove of it. Okay. I see. Is this a demo dash? Oh, it's a teleport. I forgot that those are teleports. I'll... Oh, I need to immediately go up. Holy shit, this level is cool.
right, this doesn't reverse gravity, it just reverses what I see and the controls. The vertical controls. No, I need to immediately wall bounce. Oh my god, oh that's that's normal uh normal view. Holy shit. Yeah, it was a teleport and a... That. Is this final? There's no binoculars. Yeah, I hear it. Holy shit, there's color! No strawberries in this, I assume. That was amazing. Oh my gosh, I love that level. That's the end of this episode. Let me get to a book here. So I have done six levels. Frosted Fragments, Fifth Dimension, Sea of Soup, Vertigo, Supernautica, and Pufferfish Transportation Company. And this was really fun. This was really fun. I'm 100% going to continue. I don't know if I'll be getting the strawberries. That's not really my jam. I might be getting some of the silver strawberries. Catch you guys in episode 6.